Hi Aquarius, how are you? Welcome to Told as Love Tarot. If this is your first time here. If you're returning, thanks for coming back. Um, this is for Aquarius, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus. Excuse me. Or if you have a bunch of Aquarius in your charts. <laughs> um, Aquarius, pre-message would just be something about... Um, I feel like there's an Aquarius who's being paid attention to more than they realize. Um, it's a lot of traffic out right now. Boom, boom. Um, you're being, like, on social media, however people would be able to, like, your snap stories, whatever. There's people who are interested in what you're up to. Um, I also had a message of like you recently or are needing to be tough on someone you either were tough on them or you need to be tough on them if it resonates please let me know Aquarius um, if it doesn't resonate check out the other signs in your chart and um, let's go oh Page of Cups, right off the rip. Oh, Queen of Wands. Oh, oh. High Priestess and the Ten of Swords. I feel like there might be one more. Maybe not. A lot of Pisces energy here. And then uh, this could be you, Aquarius. Uh, Knight of Swords Reversed. That's air energy. All right, so Page of Cups came out first, followed by the Queen of Cups, which is water energy, Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio, followed by the High Priestess, which is Pisces, and the Page of Cups is more water energy, so wait, heavy, you could be dealing with the Pisces, Aquarius. And then the Ten of um, Swords in Reverse. Oh, gosh. wanted to be seen what's here someone could have been a husband sing thinking about when they were single or while they were single So you know how I was just saying, like, I feel like Aquarius, you're being paid attention to and there are more people watching maybe than you think. Um, I'm just paying attention to those, like, other mermaids looking up at her. It doesn't even have to be other females. It could be just other mer people. Um, everyday favorites. Goodbye, everyday favorites. Maybe this is your everyday favorite who's watching you. But someone's like watching quietly. Oh, my leg just started to bother me. I feel like someone's quietly watching. Um, wow, this is kind of shitty right now, Aquarius. I feel like there's someone sending like negative vibes your way. And I think they're coming across as like someone who's positive and friendly. But really, they're not your friend. So you may have recently been offered something. I'm even thinking like an olive branch, someone to like make things right again, but... 
I feel like however this resonates, someone here is protected and is protecting themselves wearing like, um, amulets is in my head. Amulets, using crystals, being aware of just like, clean, cleaning their energy, protecting themselves in that spiritual sense. <clears throat> Someone who is like deeply spiritual, like it, it's in their like soul, their spirituality and their beliefs. And whoever this resonates for, I feel like there are people who are smiling in your face, but secretly they are trash talking you behind your back or even not behind your back to anybody else. They just are not being honest and actually judging the shit out of you, Aquarius. Because I have a funny feeling this is the same person. And they're smiling in your face, but in reality, look at the puss on the high priestess in this deck. She is so like, like a judgy bitch. <laughs> Aquarius, you or maybe if you're the hater, I feel like you have this shine and this sparkle that others like look up to and they envy and it's it's high priestess level. Like you're knowledgeable. Um I feel like the topics you're knowledgeable aren't I feel like the topics you are knowledgeable in, Aquarius, are not your everyday conversation topics you it's like a unique confidence with your beliefs and spirituality and like what you believe strongly in and I think you are presented with and have admirers who have crushes on you um there may be one person in particular who feels like the most and views you as the highest and you may not know this or you secretly do have a feeling that this person views you that highly but they just haven't told you. I also feel like there could be some, there literally could be something going on with someone where you're, it's like secretive. <clears throat> Maybe it's like uncomfortable for someone and that's why I keep moving around Aquarius. I feel like maybe a, uh, a water or air sign, unless that's you, that King of Swords reverse and you're turning your back, but you're, stew you're stewing and thinking about this. You may have heard from someone or someone reached out with like an apology or like that olive branch, like I said. Someone that um, you've, that you love, you've, you, it's, it's love. Like you care about this person very much. I feel like they may not know how much you care about them. Like you're keeping a, um, queen of swords, unemotional tone with them and response and just like a defensive guarded demeanor with this person because <clears throat> they may have hurt you in the past. You may have healed from this hurt or they're coming back around to heal the hurt, but I, Aquarius, I feel like I'm looking at someone and this these old readings that I had in the beginning when I started this channel just popped into my head where I was telling you it was someone who was um, not good for you and led you kind of down bad paths with um, specifically like toxic habits, addictions, drugs, drugs, sex, and rock and roll. Someone who you cared a lot about and you loved and they led you down a path that wasn't good for you or healthy for you. I feel like it's the, it could be this person. And the fact that that popped into my head like means something to me I'm gonna tilt this 
my lights broke today. So I was tilting it so you didn't see the little things I have to hold it up. <clears throat> Change is on the horizon, Aquarius. You heard it here first. It was in the Gemini reading. I'm just feeling it. Um, four of Cups and Five of Wands. Yes, I feel like uh, that Page of Cups, I've heard it as like... There's so many commercials. All right. I've heard it be called like an apology card. I also look at it as like a um, a crush having like a child childlike childish crush. Um. This person may have ha may have tried to reach out or you have tried to reach out to them several times, um, Aquarius, and they just didn't accept the offer. I feel like there was a lot of fighting and tension here. Maybe because there was a lot of fighting when someone tried to reach out and maybe reconnect, it was never accepted. But for whatever reason, I think someone has turned around. Heavy Pisces energy, because that's a uh, fish. You could be dealing with one or have it in your chart, but someone is like turned around. Around. I feel like someone's looking at things differently and seeing where things didn't work before and wanting to try things again, but try it go trying it going a different way. This could be work related. The sun reverse, that's Leo energy and temperance. That is um Sagittarius energy, but all I see is red. So all I'm seeing is like red flags. Maybe this is the person from the past. Like this is intuitive reading. I'm not straight going to the sun card and temperance. I'm just seeing first that red. And to me, like real quick, it just looks like red flags from afar. Let's just think about what I said. It just looks like red flags from afar, but up close, you would see. All right, so let me try to connect this. <clears throat> Maybe what someone thought were red flags in the past actually weren't red flags when looked at up close and considered. This is Leo energy and this is Sagittarius energy. <clears throat> I feel like there's balance. I feel like someone brings the sunshine into another person's life like they don't even realize. Like you are the sun you are the sunshine in my life. <laughs> I'm seeing like the <laughs> the baby on uh <laughs> god what are they called? The Teletubbies. Maybe this is someone's baby. <clears throat> Maybe a baby brought, like, stability into someone's life, but... <sighs> Ten of Cups reversed. There's so much traffic out there. It's annoying the hell out of me. Page of Cups again. <clears throat> so the person who, where I was saying earlier, you're being watched or there is someone paying careful attention to you... They care a lot about you, um, Aquarius, or you about them, but it's not known. It just comes across as something as like flirtatious or just like, yeah, we're like, we're cool. I really like you. But really, they have real deep feelings that they are not sharing and they're keeping a secret. They could be afraid of being hurt. They've been, they may or you may have been hurt by other people in previous relationships but 
however it resonates someone comes along and is just the light in someone's life and Aquarius I'm remembering this reading wasn't that the name now that I have two phones I can look this stuff up two phones one for the club <clears throat> I swear one of your last readings from me was about you have brought like the light into this person's life. You bring the sun into their world 11 days ago. So if this resonates, you should go check that out. That is wild that I can get the same message like that. Wow, I feel like someone knows, I'm hearing like someone knows where they effed up and like they just want to grab you and hold you and just hold on tight. Because if the sun's reverse, it's nighttime, there's no sun. But this temperance shows the sun in the background. And I just feel like maybe this is a resurgence. Like time has gone by, the sun's gone down, like a day has ended and then the sun is coming up over here. So maybe some time has passed and it appears, especially since like I'm looking at that child with the red flag and now I'm seeing this grown person with the red wings. Maybe someone had to do some growing up and did some growing up. Why are there so commercials? There's never this many. <clears throat> maybe had a lot of breaks. I, I have a something went flying. I have a feeling there's like someone not being honest about how much they care about the other. However, this resonates. Here's another card of like, well, here is a card of watching online. So maybe you have like an active social media Aquarius, like maybe you're on TikTok or um, OnlyFans. Maybe you're on. Insta ham, <laughs> the book of faces. I don't even know. What, however, it resonates. YouTube. I just feel like there is someone who watches or has been watching, but you don't know. You don't know that they've been watching or checking you out. Gosh, I did say that they could be in your stories. So maybe it's someone with like a fake account. Good Lord, the fool. And that fell with another sun on it on top of the um, sun and temperance, which I was saying looks like a sun going down, coming back up. New day, a new beginning. So is there a beginning here that's happening? The brightest card of this whole reading is now smack dab in the middle, completely opposite of the moon. Someone secret, well, <clears throat> the T, as the kids say, the T is that after there was a separation, someone acted like it didn't bother them and that they weren't really all that hurt but in reality the dynamic here was like anything else either one of you have had since or before the love the compatibility and chemistry the partnership I'm feeling like I feel like there are two people that when they are next to each other they feel equal. It doesn't feel like one is bigger than the other. It doesn't feel like one is like more important than the other. It's just like two people who are equal. But somewhere along the time, somewhere along here, there was a ending where someone is coming around and with an apology. And part of this is they never admitted or they downplayed their emotions and the hurt that they felt after the separation. Um, I feel like someone here has been kept tabs on 
either you kept tabs on someone Aquarius or they kept tabs on you meaning checking your social media maybe every so months or like if they ran into someone that you both knew like asking like hey have you heard from uh whomever um I feel like there was some growing up here that happened or needed to happen like an evolution of growth evolution of growth that makes no freaking sense Megan someone not being honest about how much they care about the other person oh ace of pentacles with the page of pentacles reverse this is why I'm like you you went through this with this person you've split and now they want to come back with a more grown I'm more grown this is a more grown offer the something more stable more real the sun set that's a, a small little offer and now it has risen again come back with this great huge pentacle and the sun rising and um setting i feel like there's a lyric in me that wants to come out if the sun should refuse to shine i think it's a led zeppelin song that's in my head right now aquarius if the sun would refuse to shine. It's like a love song, though. Um, yeah, maybe someone who was indecisive and maybe ref wanted to be kind of like solo single is wanting or th I, I don't even see thinking. I'm like, it's happening. It's going to happen. Hasn't happened yet, but it's coming. Three of Pentacles with the world's reversed. I feel like there's a heavy attraction to someone physically. I feel like maybe someone has kept pictures of someone, old pictures, and they still check these sexy photos. But <clears throat> to me, this is also someone realizing that nowhere else in the world could they find or have they found the chemistry, compatibility, and just the getting alongness that they had. Because to me, this is past tense. Because it's like nowhere else did they find it. Now I'm hearing like Joni Mitchell. Don't it always seem to go that you don't know what you've got till it's gone? They paved paradise just to put up a parking lot. But I feel like that's a relation to the person, though. Like, someone was steamrolled. This natural, wonderful, beautiful person was steamrolled and made into something ugly. This is cute, though. Like, a feeling of, like, <clears throat> ban around the world and I, I, I. Can't find anybody else like Aquarius. Or this is Aquarius thinking, I've been around the world and I can't find anyone like my baby. <laughs> hey, when the chemistry and connection is there, it's there. It's never logical it's never rational sometimes it pisses us off who we're connected and attracted to like that person whispering could be like what the hell do you see in her like what the hell do you see in her what do i see in her i see the world i think she's amazing aquarius Please let me know if this resonates. If it doesn't, check out the other signs in your chart and do what's best for you. Stay true to yourself, Aquarius.